Sometimes your mind is racing and, you know, you have anxiety, you're stressed, whatever it is. Today my mind's just racing because I had a very productive day of work and, you know, I'm going on this afternoon walk, I'm listening to music, but since my mind is racing, I'm not able to really enjoy the music. So I was like, okay, let me just take off my earphones and just let it race. And every time I have ideas, anxiety, things that I have to complete, things I, I'm behind on, write it down onto my to-do list and just build up that to-do list and let my mind search and find all the things I'm missing, all the things I'm forgetting, all the things I'm delayed on. So like, let it run itself out. And I think I'm trying to really see this as a gift. You know, a lot of people sort of, they, they don't like the fact they have a racing mind. They're like, man, like people do not want to be me because my mind is just constantly racing all the time. That's one way to view it. Or you can sort of see it as a way like, man, I have this powerful mind that can catch all these little errors in, in a bunch of things and is constantly seeing things that he can improve on, seeing things he's behind on, seeing things that he should tell his employees, coming up with ideas to solutions of problems. Like I'm embracing and I'm leaning into it as I'm sort of going on this walk and eventually after one hour it's going to slow down and by the time I get home, have dinner, I'll be sort of chilling and ready for bed.